Hey everybody, it's Alma. Welcome back to Keto Meets Menopause. Hey, hey, hey. Hey everybody, it's Alma. What is for dinner? I'll tell you, it's a burrito. Now this is a lazy keto burrito. Hey, that rhymes. I'm a poet, didn't know it. Lazy keto burrito. So guys, what I've done is sauteed about an ounce and a half of onions and an ounce and a half of poblano peppers. I sauteed them in a tablespoon of bacon drippings. And then I put in about a full cup of my leftover pulled pork. This recipe is extremely flexible. If you have leftover rotisserie chicken, use that. If you have leftover pot roast, use that. If you have leftover turkey because it's Thanksgiving, use that, guys. This is all about using our leftovers, about using everything from our grocery hauls, etc. So, and or what's in the freezer, all right? So whatever you've got protein-wise, you can probably use it. Maybe not a ham, but you get the point. So. In here, it's Spanish style. If you want it Mediterranean style, make it Mediterranean style. If you want it Cajun style, throw in some Cajun seasonings. If you want it just plain, do it that way as well. All right, guys, so this could easily be a two-person meal. Uh, let's go ahead and look at this. So this is the Joseph's flatbread. Actually, this is the Joseph lavish bread. And let's check it out. So um, each bread is two servings. The, so it's eight carbs three are dietary fiber, so five net carbs. So this entire burrito, just from the bread itself, will be 10 carbs, guys. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and lay out the meat and then roll this up. All right, guys, so I have the meat laid out. Now, from here, guys, you can do whatever you want. I'm gonna use the rest of my queso fresco and just kind of spread it across. All right, from here, guys, we'll just roll it up like you would a burrito. Alright, this guys will go into a preheated pan with some bacon drippings. See you on the stove. Alright guys, here we are. We have a warm pan. I just put my burrito inside this pan. We're going to let it cook on both sides. Probably about five minutes on each side just to get a nice browning effect. We're going to have this on a, a medium to low heat guys. Alright, let it cook through. Now, you don't really need, especially in these types of pans, you really don't need the oil. I'm just doing it for extra flavor as well as fat content. All right, guys, here is the finished one. Check it out. Oh, flip it over. Yum, yum. So, folks, this is the look of a hard working man. Yeah. I've been working very hard. <laughs> What'd you tell me yesterday that you needed in your food? Some carbs. <laughs> Some more carbs because you've been working your booty yeah. off. That's what you have today, honey. Extra carbs. Aren't you happy? I am happy. So uh, that's a keto burrito. It rhymes. That's a keto burrito? A keto burrito with that lavash wow. bread. Lavash? Lavish. Lavish. I don't know how you pronounce it. I say lavish bread. So baby, it's using leftovers and the bread. And of course some dipping sauces for you. Cheese? No, it's not cheese. It's, it's actually not? sour cream and some salsa, red salsa mixed together. Hmm. Guacamole. Guacamole, yeah. Mm, lavish bread. You like it. Back where I come from, in the old country, we eat lavish bread all day. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for that. It's very good. Very good with the meats. The dipping sauce is wonderful. Thanks, David. Mmm. Ladies and gentlemen, I am living proof that the quickest way to a man's heart is through his stomach. <laughs> yes, it is, baby. It is. This is why I am in love with my wife. Oh, I hope more reasons than that. This is the most immediate reason. <laughs> That's very true. <laughs> Good one, David. So what do you think of it? It's all leftovers and uh, just rolled into a burrito, crisped up in a pan with some bacon drippings. As my mother would say, a burrito? A burrito? Yes. A burrito. Is it a keto burrito? It is a keto burrito. Okay, now see, this is always difficult for me because it's dipping sauce, 
but I can't really dip it because it's all falling apart. Daisy, you're not getting this. <laughs> it's too spicy for you, little girl. Mm. Good? It's wonderful. Yes, I'm very good. I'm glad you're enjoying it, baby. So how low carb is lavish bread? Well, that whole bread right there is actually two servings. And after net carbs, it is 10 net carbs. So it's not terrible, but right now you're pretty much doing a nomad, right? Pretty much. Pretty much. I, I did have a uh, uh, tortilla-less breakfast taco today. Well, that's okay. You've been, it's, it's hot. Yeah. And you're working outdoors and and I'm burning calories. You are right and left. So you get a little extra protein, a little extra fat, and uh, definitely some carbs. And you're gonna get a side salad with that. It's just off to the side right now. <laughs> We're way not off to the side. Way off to the side. All right, baby. So give me your review. An absolute perfect ten. I, I've I've been wanting to reintroduce uh, some type of uh, bread into my diet. I just honestly figured that you would just kind of grab it and eat it with your hands. I've got a camera on me right now. <laughs> yeah. When that, when that, uh, when that uh, lens turns off, I'm going full chrome magnum. Neanderthal. Well, oh. you, got, you got the forehead for it. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Honey, the viewing public should just know. You it's not that, it's just the second time I've heard that today. Oh! <laughs> we all tease him because he does have, he's got such a pronounced... I have a very prominent forehead. He does. And look a unibrow. Look how cute he is though. <laughs> you are cute. I'm not a Neanderthal. You want to turn your head sideways so they can see how... No. Please? No, I don't want to. <laughs> see. Well, it doesn't look there. It's just, yeah, it doesn't look that bad, but it is. I got a big it's cute, forehead. though. It's because my brain is so big, it's protruding. Exactly, out of honey. Because I'm uh, so smart. You are so smart. All right, guys. Hope you try it. Let me know if you do. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye. <laughs> That's my boy. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you so much for allowing me to spend time with you. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification button so that you'll know each time I post a new video. All right, guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Choice Wednesday. It's Onito. Now here's my wife to teach us keto. Pork rinds, pork rinds, rah, rah, rah. Carbohydrates, carbohydrates, blah, blah, blah. Like <laughs> tea.